Are you ready, kids? I can't hear you. Who lives in a tugboat under the sea? SpongeBob. Okay. Back by popular demand, it's SpongeBob Baseball. And you'd be smiling too if you had this. This is my 1985 Tokai LS80. It was a gold top at one time. I bought it as a project guitar. And it didn't just need a little bit of TLC. It's been put back together. <clears throat> it, this one does have the dimple in the middle. It's a 1985. And um, MK2 pickups. One piece back. One piece neck. And I believe it's an LSA. It is a uh, two piece seam uh, solid maple top. Uh, you will see the other photos of when I, the progress of it being a homemade gold top. It looked okay from a distance, but when you got on top of it, um, it was really kind of terrible looking. Thing played fabulous. I bought two guitars from this guy. We'll just say hi, FD. And uh, you rock, and what else you got? And I'll buy something else from you. Um, <clears throat> and then I had it done in a blood ox. It's a very, very, very deep burgundy um, lacquer finish. Almost looks black. Um, beautiful job done by Jim Williford at String Instrument Works. Um, it used to have a tremolo on it. This thing was all messed up. Uh, the guy who I bought it from can attest to uh, how this headstock was so messed up. Divots out of it. You know, the things we did in the 80s with whatever. And, uh, oh, we're going to make this thing better. Okay, well, I don't know. But um, this guitar smokes now. And um, it is a 1985. And like I said, I will post other pictures with it. Um, the way I got it and came with the original case and everything. But this thing has, a, um, uh, I would say, a medium slim neck. And this thing smokes... It's in great shape. It's like I said, it's had some issues, but uh, it's all ready to go now and ready to rock. And that's why SpongeBob is smiling. That's the neck pickup. Now we switch to the bridge.
middle position. Signing on another one soon. Rock on, keep rocking, bros. <laughs> 